Hello all. Today we're going to be using one of the new Stampin' Up! stamp sets for the tutorial. This is a level 2 hostess set out of the new catalog and it's called A Little Something Something. Really cute. It works with a lot of the punches. You can see the star punch here. There's a new punch coming out which is going to be a heart punch. This is going to work with, um, I believe this is the label one, square. And then there's this stamp that I'm going to be using for the tutorial today, which works with the one and three fourths circle. So let's get started. So a while back, I did a tutorial on how to get multiple colors on a stamp. I'm going to do that again today, but a little different. So for this image, what I want to do is I want to get two colors on here. Let me show you what the image looks like if it's just one color. Here it is. It's cute, but I think we could take it up a notch. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to ink this stamp up and Kiwi Kiss. Get it really good. Then, in order to put my second color on, I'm going to use my blender pen. And what I'm going to be doing is actually removing some of the color. So what I want to do on this case is I want to put a different color on the words. So all I have to do is take my blender pen across it, remove some of the color, scribble it off on a scrap sheet of paper. And also what I'm doing is I'm removing the lighter color to put on a darker color. I think that works best. just off the letters. So I've done thanks and now I'm going to do a bunch at the bottom. Okay. So now that I've taken care of that, move my scribble paper and my blender pen. And what I'm going to do is come in with chocolate chip and I'm going to use the wide tip and I'm going to go over the letters that I just removed the ink from. So the thanks got that all colored in and then a bunch. Okay. Now I can huff on the image to get it juicy again because of course the Kiwi Kiss um, I inked up a while ago so I'm going to huff on it <sighs> and then stamp my image and there you go two colors and then like I said before you can use your one and three fourth circle punch to punch out this image it fits right in there and there we go. So I'll let you see the difference between the two images. So this is the one just in one color. This is the one in two. See, it has a little more pop to it. Let me show you my finished card that I made with this image. So here's the finished card. And you can see once again where I used the Kiwi Kiss and the chocolate chip. And just for a comparison, I'm going to put in the one color and let you see the card that way. See it's cute but it just doesn't have that same flair. I like it much better with the two colors. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed today's tutorial and as usual visit me on my blog www.mylifesart.com. Thanks.